Are you tired of students losing interest in your literacy lessons? Are you sick of students reading texts on a superficial level? At Amy's Amazing Lessons, we have the perfect solution for you. And with today's special offer, we can save you money. The lesson package we have on sale today includes work from the acclaimed author, Sean Tan. This special lesson offer includes critical literacy and visual literacy. So what is visual literacy? Visual literacy is the ability to make meaning through the interpretation of images. When reading texts such as picture books, students use word image interactions to make meaning. For example, they examine elements such as the use of colour, shape and size to contribute to meaning. But how does visual literacy fit into this special offer? The lesson begins with a read to and discussion of Sean Tan's book, The Rules of Summer. Students will use visual literacy while discussing the text. During this discussion, students will examine visual elements of pictures and discuss how they affect their interpretation of the meaning. Some of the questions that will be asked include, what is real and what is imaginary? How do you think the characters are feeling? And have you ever felt like this? Tan's work leaves a lot of the pictures up for interpretation and so students will be able to discuss all the different elements of each picture. But wait, didn't you say the lesson also contained critical literacy? Why, yes I did! This exclusive lesson offer also contains elements of critical literacy. Critical literacy is a framework that encapsulates the underlying social aspects of literacy. The core values of this framework include equity, social justice and valuing of cultural and individual diversity. Critical literacy allows students to examine texts through a critical lens and understand the socio-political conventions that influence them. When reading and discussing this book, critical literacy is incorporated through questions such as what do you think the author thinks of rules? This is a great topic for discussion as the book includes silly rules and sensible rules. The Rules of Summer juxtaposes realistic and unrealistic elements and by using critical literacy, students can discuss the text through a new critical lens. For example, the page with the text Never Leave a Red Sock on the Clothes line, students interpret the picture discussing how much is real, how much is imagined and why this rule might be included in the book. Wow, your students will be using higher order thinking skills in ways you never thought possible. But that's not all. This lesson also contains prediction. When you get to the page titled Never Lose a Fight, you will conceal the picture from students and ask them to predict what they think the picture will look like. After students make predictions about the page, you will show the class the image. Critical and visual literacy questions will be asked, including what do we see in the pictures that isn't there in words? What makes you think so? And whose perspective is it from? Do you think the other character would see it that way? The next rule, never wait for an apology, is followed by several pages of pictures to illustrate how long you could be waiting. Students will discuss the use of colour, the pictures changing from day to night, size, the room the boy is trapped in, and the many interpretations for what the prose could represent. But wait, there's more. After the read to and discussion, students come up with their own rule and write a short story about it. Students are scaffolded through the writing process and include visual literacy through their own illustrations. As a special offer for today's lucky viewers, this lesson can be expanded into a small unit with students publishing their work into their own book. That's amazing! This lesson is EAL friendly as it involves explicit instruction, vocabulary clarification, discussion and visual literacy so that students with limited English knowledge can understand the task through the book's pictures. Happy teaching! Created using Powtoon.